the atypicality of the 107th is mainly due to its origin, because this car is based on the development of the manufacturer of some of the most reliable Japanese cars. The fact is that this small car is the fruit of the joint work of the PSA concern, Peugeot and Citroën, and Toyota, and the main technical stuffing went to her from the Japanese. So, in early 2000, the two auto giants decided to join forces to create a new compact model. The project was named B0, and the alliance built a new Toyota plant specifically for it. Peugeot, Citroën, Automobile, TCPA, in Czech Colon, located near Prague. As a result of common efforts, at the beginning of 2005, a pretty triplets were born, Peugeot 107, Citroën C1, and Toyota Ego. In addition to the general technique, the design of these models is very similar, especially for the two French, and looking at the profile, only connoisseurs will be able to determine the brand of the baby. Models of all manufacturers are represented by two modifications, three and five door hatchbacks. Due to its compact size and good-natured appearance, the 107th won the greatest popularity among the beautiful half of humanity. Moreover, he often became the first car on which the driving experience of the ladies was polished, and as a result, quite a lot of such cars were in minor road troubles. Traces of rust on the panels are a clear sign of poor quality body repair and a reason to conduct a more thorough inspection by specialists, while there are no comments on the corrosion resistance of the watt during trouble-free driving. By the way, these small cars have a tarnished reputation. Regular rubber seals on the door often do not provide the necessary tightness. As a result, during precipitation, water often seeps into the cabin. This design flaw was officially recognized by the manufacturer, and to eliminate it, a special factory set of additional seals was released, which were glued around the perimeter of the doorways. But during the second restyling in 2012, the problem was radically eliminated, through the use of new seals of a different shape, which provided the necessary protection for the interior from moisture. The style of a toy appearance is also reflected in the cabin, this is facilitated by numerous circles, air vents, stove controls, podiums for front power window buttons, a large speedometer, cup holders, and a tachometer on a separate leg. Of the unusual features of the five-door, it is also worth noting the absence of traditional sliding windows on the rear doors, they are made as slightly opening windows. Despite its compact size, there is enough space for four crew members to land. The seats are quite flat, and the front ones with a minimal hint of lateral support. But with the similar cut of the cabin, the trunk suffered and the stowed state it is purely conditional, only 140 liters. If you need to carry more luggage, the cargo compartment can be increased to 710 liters by folding down the rear seat backs. Two engines were intended for the Peugeot 107, one native, French, a 1.4 HD diesel four-cylinder unit, and the second, a 1.0 liter gasoline three-cylinder engine borrowed from Toyota. Moreover, only gasoline modifications were officially delivered to Ukraine, which make up the lion's share of the 107s in the domestic car market. Diesel versions came to us through the efforts of private distillers and are extremely rare in our country. According to the employees of the branded service station, in general, the Japanese unit has proven itself well. Unless it is sensitive to the oil level, even with a slight drop, the pressure lamp does not light up, the timing chain starts to tap, which is caused by the weakening of the hydraulic tensioner due to insufficient fairy tail pressure. If you do not pay attention to the increased noise of work, then by 150,000 kilometers the chain may stretch and require replacement. And this pleasure is not cheap, it changes along with the hydraulic tensioner and sprockets. Otherwise, there are no problems with the engine. As a rule, individual ignition coils are trouble-free. Candles are used quite expensive, iridium, which on average would stand about 40,000 kilometers, although when replacing it is quite possible to install ordinary ones. There are no complaints about the operation of the proprietary Toyota VVTi variable valve timing system, which gives the motor elasticity. The three-cylinder unit does not impress with its dynamics. According to passport data, acceleration to 100 km h is about 14 seconds. Although such a little car never claimed the laurels of a speedboat, its main advantage is in another, in high fuel efficiency. So, in the urban cycle, it consumes about 5.5 liters per hundred run and on the highway at a speed of 90 to 100 km h about 4.0 liters. With similar characteristics, the Peugeot 107 is able to outdo many competitors, Diwu Meitais, Smart, etc.
the plastic finish is quite high quality and silent. The upholstery has good wear resistance. Visibility is excellent, but the sound insulation is weak. A tachometer on a leg was offered as an option and is not common. Despite the compact size of the car, its creators carved out the necessary reserve of space for normal passenger boarding. Even a person with a height of under 1.8 m can sit down by himself. Peugeot 107, as well as its other single platform relatives, is represented by two modifications, three and five door hatchbacks. Three doors are less popular than versions with more doors. Among competitors, the trunk of the 107th is average in size, 140-710 liters versus 165-625 liters for Cherry QQ and Diwoo Made Eyes and 225-910 liters for Hyundai i10. Officially, only petrol versions of the Peugeot 107 were sold, while European buyers could also choose a turbo diesel version. Megane 3 offers an extensive range of gearboxes. So, with a 1.6-liter gasoline engine, a 5-speed mechanics and a CVT variator are aggregated, with a 2.0-liter, already a 6-speed manual gearbox and a variator, and with a 1.5-liter turbo diesel, a 6-speed mechanics and robot EDC with the same number of gears. Robot began to be installed on cars manufactured after the first restyling in 2012, and domestic servicemen do not have accumulated operating experience for these gearboxes. A characteristic feature of EDC operation is sluggishness when driving in toffees, when the box chooses between first and second gear. Compared to its predecessor, the MCP has become more reliable, no characteristic malfunctions have been identified. Recall that Megane 2 had problems with the clutch and with the seal between the clutch housing and the gearbox. According to the manufacturer's recommendations, the lubrication in all fluence units is designed for the entire life of the gearbox, although when buying a used car for durable operation of the gearbox, mechanics are still advised to change the lubricant and do this at intervals of 60,000 km in the automatic transmission and 90,000 km in MCP. All Peugeot 107 front-wheel drive cars, which were aggregated with five-speed gearboxes, traditional mechanics, and a robotic gearbox with automatic gear shifting and clutch control mechanisms. The most widespread cars with a robot. This unit has both automatic and manual modes. The peculiarity of his work is delays and jerks when switching, which, however, is typical for most analogs from other manufacturers. The most important remark to the robotic gearbox is the short-lived clutch, which, depending on the skill of the drivers, can withstand a mileage of 20 to 60,000 kilometers. To extend the life of the clutch, mechanics are advised to follow a number of simple rules. When stopping for more than 30 seconds, move the lever to neutral, do not slip, and when shifting gears, release the gas a little. In addition, it is advisable to periodically carry out the so-called initialization of the gearbox, reprogramming the ECU, which reconfigures the operation of the clutch as it wears out. A signal for this will be increased twitching when shifting gears. An important advantage of the robot of the 107th is that, unlike many other such gearboxes, there are no failures of actuators, gear shifting and clutch control mechanisms. But in rare mechanical gearboxes, no characteristic problems were identified. Maintenance of both types of gearboxes consists in regular oil changes every 60,000 kilometers. At the back, older versions, until 2012, pictured can be recognized by the bright red protective cap of the headlights, the newer ones have a rich maroon color. The baby's chassis is harsh, and the unevenness of the roadway is well felt when driving. However, it is quite reliable. In the McPherson front suspension, most often you have to change the stabilizer struts, and this usually happens at a run of 70,000 kilometers. At the same time, silent blocks of levers are able to withstand at least 120,000 kilometers, and ball bearings, at least 150,000 kilometers. Branded consumables are supplied complete with levers, although they can be found separately in the non-original. In the rear semi-independent suspension, with a run of about 100,000 kilometers, wheel bearings must be changed. Such repairs are expensive, since the bearings, branded and non-original, are changed as an assembly with the hub but the silent blocks of the beam are considered eternal. There are no comments on the durability of shock absorbers. The steering of all 107s is equipped with electric power steering. As a rule, this node works without problems. Consumables are also distinguished by their enviable durability, tie rods and tips, which are capable of reaching more than 150,000 kilometers. 
the brake system is equipped with front ventilated discs and rear drums. According to the mechanics, there are no complaints about the operation of the brakes. Even with the slight drop in oil level, the timing chain starts to tap. Ignoring this subsequently threatens with an expensive replacement of the chain kit along with the hydraulic tensioner and sprockets. Over time, the trunk lid on the lock latch may begin to tap. This is treated with adjustment or lubrication. Design flaw, leaky door seals. Later, the manufacturer released a set of additional rubber bands, which dealers install under warranty. The weak point of a robotic gearbox is the clutch, which, if driven ineptly, can wear out after 20,000 kilometers.